Hey, what's going on guys? It's Bunkovai here for MMOBomb.com and welcome back to Universal Monsters Online. We've got a special little video here today because of course this video is about you guys. This is a community event within uh, Universal Monsters Online where we had the MMOBomb community come out, play with some of us, and play with some of the developers from actual Universal Monsters Online published by Big Point. Some, some of the Big Point developers I should say. So if you look we have UMO, Just Effects, and Pixel as well as Airwolf, three different developers from uh, Universal Monsters Online, uh, aka Big Points Game. And I'm just in here as Mrs. Frankenstein, the bride of Frankenstein. We had, uh, I actually had Just Effects tell me just earlier that he really enjoyed the sound effects I made for Frankenstein when I originally played Frankenstein in uh, my first First Look video. So I thought, hey, why not? Let's use some bride of Frankenstein this time. So we'll go for a little bit of a different approach to their audio. So we're coming in here, and if you guys don't remember, the way this works is unlike on traditional MOBA, you gotta, as a monster, you gotta deck, basically attack these buildings and kill the little inhabitants, the little peasants inside, because you need their souls or essence to level yourself up and ultimately capture the damsel in distress, not defress, distress. So I am a ranged uh, character as well here. I've got electrical charge, creates an aura on the ground that deals damage to all enemies within, jolt which restores health to any ally, and power flow increases movement, health, and health, re health regeneration and speed, rather, of an ally for 7 seconds. So somewhat of a so semi-support role, you could say. My ultimate, which I unlock at level 3, I believe, is a potent elixir, which causes all enemies within a circle to take extra damage each time they're hit up to 3 times for the next 15 seconds. So kind of like a debuffer, buffer, which is very nice to see that they have included different types of monsters in here, not just all, you know, attack monsters as well. Because you would think, hey, don't all monsters destroy? Don't they all go after all the humans? And while that is true, some of them, you know, some of them have somewhat of a soul. And oh, here we go. Got a guy coming to me on the left-hand side, but I'm just going to come over here and back up my good friend, you know, Magic Man. And, oh, God. All right, get away there. Oh, don't hit me. All right, so let's see. Can I heal myself? I can. So I can indeed heal myself there with my potion. I'm going to see if I can take out this building here. Oh, Magic Man taking some hits there from the tower. I'm going to kind of harass this guy as much as possible. Try to get him out of the way. I can use my little heal here. Come here, Magic. Let me use my magic to heal you. Give you some love. No, Magic, come back. No, okay. We'll come back here, and I am going to be able to heal him up there just like that. It looks like we have two heals on the team, which is very nice. It would be nice to actually have a slow. I don't believe I actually have a slow, although I can increase our speed and health regeneration. Is he killing some barrels? I want to kill some barrels with me. But yeah, the goal here is not, of course, kill creeps, but of course, kill these buildings, which contain the unlucky citizens within. So let's go ahead here. I'm going to heal him up quite again there. i got to get that heal off you there. And then continue forward and pushing. Ah, oh, come on. No, you pixel, pixel. Okay, I guess they should go for the pixel. I'm sorry, pixel. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> it was a bad idea for doing what I did, but I can hear the, your airwolf up. And then let's come on and just get out of here. So we can use this here to make our little buddies go faster and run away. Oh, no, wrong thing to attack. No, I don't want to get hit by that. Oh, God. Keep running. Keep running. Steamroller's going to steam me over. I'm gonna give myself a little heal here. Oh, there we go. Nice little heal. And hopefully we'll be able to... No! There. Put the damage on the ground. Why not? You shall not pass. Or rather you should, but just take a little bit of damage. Alright, so hopefully... Yeah, okay. Pixel's here. Gonna defend me. I'm gonna give myself a little heal here. And I'm gonna give him a buff. Hopefully we'll be able to chase after him a little bit. Going a little bit slow here at the moment. Oh, no! Airwolf! Oh, he gets away. Okay. We're gonna do the old uh, cock blockage. And that is where we basically make it so they can actually pass us. And these guys were invisible somehow. But all right. Let's see here. Ah, auto attack away. It's all right, guys. I've got the heals. You got the heals. We got the heals. We got everything. We're all good. See, look at this. Infinite kiting. You can't do anything with Miss Mrs. Frankenstein here. What are you going to do? Oh, we have more people actually coming up, unfortunately. Do have to make sure to not get anybody. I'm going to put that down there. So if they want to actually stand in it, they can. Otherwise, they are going to get hit by this damage. Oh, I got to get away. I'm, I'm healing you. There you go, Pixel. Fly, fly. Fly, fly, Pixel. You got this, Pixel. You got this. Pixel's going into town, getting some nice regeneration there. I'm going to come away. I'm going to attack some barrels of apples when I can. Look at that. That is some good micromanagement right there. Coming back around. Oh, there goes the heal. Backing up just a bit. And my teammates are nowhere to be found, unfortunately. But it's okay, because I can actually increase my regeneration speed here as well as he can ah there's go 
Request for an auto target feature. When you're not targeting someone else, just auto target it on yourself. That would be a nice addition there. Gonna get myself a heal up there on Wolf. And then we're gonna try to come back in here for some nice gankage. I'm the only actual range one in this little group of us right here. Oh, this guy doesn't know what's going on. He's out of place. He's not gonna be able to do anything. Look at here. Ah, oh, right there in the face. What are you gonna do when they come for you, bad boy? Oh, look at that. Nice kill. I get the kill, which is always awesome. And we're gonna get the block in here. Go for a double kill. Oh, almost a double kill, but I have reached level three. Now I can use Potent Elixir. Causes all the minis, of course, to take extra damage for up to three attacks. Always nice to have here. Get some little auto attacks in there. I wish I could drag the screen just a bit so I can get those auto attacks a little bit better. But there he is, of course, out of range. Let's see if we can get this. Uh, can I cast it there? No, gotta actually be within range, which is a little bit curious for that. But here we have the wolf man. I don't know where he's going. But we're just gonna go ahead and destroy these buildings here. Get some more civilians in our tummies. I don't know. What does is, what is the bride of Frankenstein do with him? I guess she just takes him home and dresses him up as dolls, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, let's see what we got here. Just gonna use my little auto attack here. Oh, how dare you claw at me? Come on. Ah, there we go. I'm gonna keep backing up here. Oh, God. It's okay, but I'm like Mrs. Frankenstein. I got, I got all the powers. All right, come on. Come on. Right there. All right, use my heal myself a little bit. Just gonna back away. Now, I'm curious. I see these rankings, but does that mean that they automatically get ranked up currently and they're just not showing? Or is that just like some indicative of like that is an ability? And I totally just wasted that, but that's okay. That's what happens. Gonna get the backup here. I'll get this to myself. And then we'll do potent elixir. Here we go. Taking extra damage for three attacks. Come on, you got so close. Get him. Yeah, there we go. Nicely done. Mr. Go Invisible here. He is now so close. You get a little slow. Do we have a slow? Ah, uh, God, come on. Yeah. Ah, uh, just, I wish if I could just get that ability a little bit farther casted. It's kind of hard with all the, the blocking going on. But you guys, you're going to get close. I'm going to put that there. Just to kind of keep you away. Kind of kite you away, you know. Objectively. You know, you got to learn how to use your abilities just to kind of zone people out. Always good to have that ability or that uh, a advantage in a mobile, I should say. Having the ability to kite people properly using abilities and kind of zone them out. I mean, there are no minions here, but still there is a zoning mechanic to it. You know, you're zoning them from you actually not taking... Uh, the uh, creeps, so they basically prevent them from taking, from you taking the creeps, rather. Anyways, let's go ahead and move on here. What else do we got around here? Yumo Pixel doing a good job here of uh, helping us take out these little buildings. You know, come on, filthy peasants. This this place belongs to us. This is our location. This is all about us. You know, the monsters. Too long have the simple human-minded people just been taking over this location. We have to show them that we are the better species, right? As monsters. Or is that just like the storyline for, uh, I guess it's just the storyline for, for X-Men rather. Alright, so let's put this down here. I'm going to put that, and then I'm going to put this, just to kind of keep them away. Come on, Pixel. I got you, buddy. Give me the heals. Stay alive, buddy. No! No, Pixel. Oh, God. Alright, so now I'm, I'm in some heap of trouble here. I will have my ability to go faster, though, and regenerate pretty soon. So I'm just going to heal myself there, as well as get myself my little buff here and come back. Mana regeneration quite fast on uh, on Frankenstein here. Mrs. Frankenstein, I should say. So let's see if we actually can keep them from pushing up so far. Or rather, if we can just, you know, go off on our own. We don't need everybody else. Go off on our own, see if we can find some more buildings to destroy. With my auto attacks of death and destruction. Where's my bolts? Shouldn't I have bolts coming out of my... I don't remember the whole story or the actual imagery. But if I do recall correctly, there was bolts coming out of both him and Mrs. Frankenstein. So they could update the artwork a little bit to include that. I will say this. I'm only saying it now because I know the developers are actually going to watch this video. So hopefully, hey, let's, you know, if, if it's incorrect and she actually doesn't use bolts in her, in her neck, then hey, that's my fault. But look at this auto attack range. I can completely zone out that tower, no problem, which is just fine here. Going to destroy that building. The citizens run out. And it actually is a good opportunity for me to go ahead and take out more of these citizens and kind of kite around here because that little minion that actually does form does allow me to oh come on come on all right so let's see if i can actually get it from here it does allow me to then tank the actual tower for a little bit longer looks like they're pushing up pretty hard and we're pushing up the middle i'm kind of just doing my own thing down here I'm trying to get this thing oh but they get a kill let's see we can actually take a look at that just by hovering over by clicking our mouse what's going on over there they're doing a good job pushing out the middle actually quite far I just got out all those little, all those little citizens here. 
But I need, I need team support. You can't really do it by yourself, guys. This is a MOBA game. This is about team support. So we did just take this tower out. Let's go ahead and move up here. Wow, this just affects already level 6. I don't know what I've been doing wrong, but he is level 6. They're getting those kills. I just hit level 4. Let me go over there with my, my hubby, basically. My, uh, my husband there, Mr. Frankenstein, just effects. Just effects told me before the game, he was like, I really liked how you made all the sounds with, uh, Mr. Frankenstein. And, uh, hey, go ahead and put those in. Now, why can't I actually attack bees? There must be some reason I can't attack bees. All right, there we go. Now I can attack those. It's gonna keep hitting this building here. I need level 5. As quickly as possible. Getting 10 experience there. Oh, it's so far away. Now, those little peasants also heal you up some. So you do get some health regeneration when you actually capture them, capture the souls essentially. As well as some much needed experience. Only get the experience if you actually run over them. So this guy's almost down, 15, oh no. You do actually get the experience I think if, uh, if you're around them. But uh, you know what, I'm not quite sure. I don't really remember, well, I'm not gonna say that off the, oh God, what happened to him? He just disappeared. Uh, that was completely wasted, but all right, let's see here. Let's keep killing this building. We will find out if we get the experience no matter what. So we do have a guy here. You and Airwolf going after him, but they don't even seem interested. Whatever. We're just going to keep pushing forward here. Ah, keep killing these buildings here. And now, if I get this, I do get the experience. And I don't get any of the experience, looks like, if he does. Yeah. So only the peasants give experience if you indeed pick up the experience. The other experience from, like, the, the larger minions, etc., those do give you AUE experience for everyone. So that is something to take in mind. 15 experience here. And I kind of want to support these guys, but I'm not really sure what I can do. Other than just run face forward into those turrets. Those turrets hurt super bad. Alright. So let's go ahead and I'm just going to put that there. Let's get some little bit of damage on that. This guy is chasing me, but you know. It's alright. Can't do nothing about that. Now, wait, wait, look at this. We're going to do this little concoction here. And he should die. Die. Auto attack. Come on. Oh my god, auto attack. Wow. Wow. I can't believe he survived. I gotta give that to him. So close. I think I should use my ultimate and then use my Q. But I don't actually know if my ultimate applies to my Q. Alright, you gotta get away. Alright, come on. Come on. There we go. There's one. That's good for there. Let's get a double. Yes, a double kill. Double kill. What an epic bank from Just FX, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, that is great. Great play there by Just FX. The bait. So good. Let's keep giving him some buffs there. Making sure that he's alright. I'll keep following him around. Oh, man. Alright. There we go, buddy. Need more people. That is correct. We do not have enough people to take those towers. Hopefully, we can push more. We can actually get some more citizens over here. Citizen, come here. There we go. Oh, we got a guy coming up from behind, unfortunately. Oh, we got a couple guys coming up from behind. This is not a good location for me to be. Ladies and gentlemen, there's four or five guys on me. I've got to move fast. And there goes the stun off of me. I'm running, guys. I'm trying to get away. There's the heal. And I think I've lost most of them. Oh, man. Wolfman is definitely indeed coming for me. I get my... Oh, guys. I'm so dead. Oh, guys. No. I can do this. I can totally survive. What an epic chase, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be the chase of the ages here. Getting a nice little bait and juke there going through. Able to just skirt through it despite the uh, auto attacks and the stuns. And I have escaped with my life. Oh no! He's trying to cut me off! <laughs> I thought I was good. Alright, let's escape to the north here. Let's see if we can go back around. Quiet and sneaky like. We will try to team up with our teammates once more. I think I've... Oh god, he's found me! Oh, no, no, no. Okay, so we gotta use, we gotta use our auto attack, or our third spell here to speed us up, give us some little health regeneration, much needed. I would like to see our, the health, uh, an option for the health to be displayed immediately, rather, instead of just having to kind of hover over to see exactly how much you have. But ladies and gentlemen, I just completely distracted two or three members of their team. I feel like I'm like some kind of commentator. Ladies and gentlemen. Alrighty here, so let's go in here, see if we can get these attacks. No, I'm gonna save you. Alright, let's get that. And here we go. Nah. Using lots of damage there. Hopefully going to get some auto attacks. Some kills. We do have this AoE damage here. But unfortunately we are getting taken out. And I just healed the wrong person. But enemy force will do this down. We do have to back out though unfortunately. And I have no more spells. Pixel you must run. You must get out of here. 
I'll give you some little speed boost there. We should be okay. We gotta split directions. They gotta choose. They're gonna go for a pixel, looks like. I'm gonna come around. They know they can't catch me. Because I am the gingerbread man, of course. The one made out of different human parts and bodies. Oh, man. That would be a weird gingerbread man. But anyways, let's go ahead here if we, if we can offer some defensive support. You, I'm coming. All right. You got some buffs for you. Let's do this. Ultimate time. Come on. Ugh. Everybody in the AoE. And there's mass hysteria. And massive damage going out. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, look at this damage. No one has seen quite a massacre of this size in quite a while. Pixel's getting healed, and we are going back in battle. What an amazing turnaround, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh, man, I feel like I'm from, like, the 20s or 40s. All right, let's keep moving on. Doing a great job here with our little push. A nice turnaround there. They thought they were going to have us on the run, but no. It was just a mighty bait. All right, let's get these down. Capture these little guys. These frightful little humans. There's a fight going down, but I have to collect more humans. All right, so let's go. Oh, uh, look at all the AOE damage going out. Nobody knows what's going on. It's mass hysteria. <laughs> we got this. We got this. All right, so look here. Getting some nice auto attacks here. Just Effects is going to live as I am going to heal him quite nicely. No, Just Effects. Run away, Just Effects. Run away. I will support you, Just Effect. No. All right, come on, come on, come on. Uh, come on. Uh, yeah. There you go. And he's going to get a little bit of healing there. I got my ultimate back in a couple seconds. We should be okay. Don't block me. Don't block me, bro. Doing a little bit of AoE damage there. We should be able to get that as it comes down. I'm going to keep cutting them just a bit. Give myself a little bit of a heal. We do out now that we've actually gone to their base and I believe destroyed or taken down the force field. We do indeed have to actually take the damsel in distress to the base in order for us to actually complete our win. So here we go. The epic fight you've all been waiting for. Mass hysteria down. So much AoE. Immediately I get a kill there off of the invisible man. Going here using the auto attacks to my advantage. We're going to get a double kill, guys. Yes, we're going to get a double kill. Didn't quite get the triple kill. Maybe we can get the triple kill here. Uh, just a little bit more. Nope. Double and another double from Magic Man, I believe, too. Nicely done, Magic Man. Low health indeed. I will support you. There you go. He does have the health, and we are now running back to the base. And I believe that was almost a pure massacre. Quite well done. Only one barely escaping, I believe. Arch Notch. Arch Notch escaping. This was Bibimbap. 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 It's a sort of food, I believe. And Muerte San. Along with two other community individuals, no, no more than likely. And we are looking to actually win this, guys. Coming back over here quite nice. Let's look at the let's look at the map there if we can actually scroll over. There we go. So close there. Just effects bringing him in. We're all bringing him in for the win here. Congratulations to Team Dark, because that's Team Light on the other side, I guess. Team Jacob or Team Edward, we can do that too. That's werewolves and uh, vampires. So uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this commentary, guys. And uh, it was very fun, really fun to play with you guys here on uh, Universal Monsters Online. And do check it out yourselves if you haven't already. A browser-based MOBA with a monster theme and uh, not your typical MOBA. So I definitely uh, enjoyed my time here and uh, hope you guys enjoyed it as well. And I see you. I will see you guys from the next video. This has been Smokeify. Smokeify, out!